roasty. Yeah, sorry, pea brain woman. Maybe that's why you should focus more on two slices of bread, peanut butter, and jelly than political commentary. Maybe you should leave that to the big brain men. The jail. That's what made me a statist. I said, what? How could you say it's not desirable that we have different people living here together in harmony? Like, why do you want that? Why is that a good thing? Then the dominoes start to fall. What if they were men? Would they be acting the same way? And then I think, well, what if, what if there were no women in Congress? And then I think, what if women didn't even vote for Congress? What if they didn't even vote for president? And then I think, what kind of a world would we live in? You know, and then I, then I start doing research. I start looking at the numbers. I start looking at, you know, what would the 2016 election look like if only men voted? Hmm. And then I look at 2012 and 2008, and I look at every election for the past 40 years. And then I control for other factors like race and other things. When Spencer called me out, he said, uh, Nick, why don't you just leave the alt right? If Would you say that me having sex with my dog is the same thing as me having sex with a black man? No. I but they're both, they would both be degenerate. Oh! This. And then I think, man, it seems like if we shrank the suffrage, if we shrank enfranchisement in terms of the vote, back to what it used to be, white property owning men, we tarts just find a white girlfriend. The real right is race mixing. Plenty of people who disagree with me and who are critical of Israel and are not anti-Semitic. There are plenty of people who disagree with me on all the aforementioned issues. I've mentioned some of their names and that is perfectly fine. If you want to discuss Nick Fuentes specifically, I suggest again, you go back and you look at his videos. Of uh, I suggest that you go back and you look at videos of him, uh, actual videos of him doing things like in which Nick Fuentes pulls out a switchblade and starts randomly jabbing it in the air while talking about me. No, I don't think he's a mainstream conservative. And I think that it's to conflate mainstream conservatism with that kind of garbage. Thanks. No,